Buongiorno, Merava. Please come in. Oh, excuse the clutter. I have not had time to tidy up since my trip. You sailed from Rhodes, no? See, si. how did you know? We were on the same ship. I am Ezio Auditore. Sofia Sartor. Have we met? We have now. May I have a look around? Prego. Most of my best homes are in the back. It is nice to meet another Italian in this district. Most keep to the Venetian Quarter and Galata. Altrettanto. I assume the Ottoman war with Venezia would have driven most of you away. I lived here with my parents when I was a girl. The war pushed us out. But I always knew I would return. Have you found anything interesting? Mio Dio! Who put that there? Incredibile. Where does it lead? Why don't we find out? Who are you, Messere? Only the most interesting man in your life. Ah, oh, che presuntuoso. A presto, Sofia. I will return in a moment. Salve, Ezio. That took some time. What did you find? Something that may interest you. Mio Dio, che meraviglia! And here is my shop. Look at the margins. Strange symbols. And these are titles of books. Rare books! A few of these have not been seen for more than a millennium. Nicolo Polo hid these books around the city. This map should tell us where. Hmm. You're beginning to interest me, vaguely. From what I can tell, I need to find these three books first. They may contain clues to locate the rest of these. Molto curioso. Another was found beneath Topkapa Palace, but there is still time to reach the others. Found by whom? Men who do not read. Sophia, can you decipher this map? Help me find these books. Can I borrow them when you are finished? We will work something out. Mia cara, the strings of fate have drawn us together. Two Italiani, lost and alone in the Orient. Do you not feel the... magnetismo? I feel many things, Messere. Nausea above all. Is this man bothering you, Sofia? Excuse me, Messere, but the lady and I are... Oh! Oh! Il diavolo in persona! Stay back! Duccio, a pleasure. Run, buona donna! Run for your life! Who was that? Un cane. He was engaged to my sister many years ago. And what happened? His cazzo was engaged to six others. Chiedo venia. So what brings you to these docks? I took a break from my work to retrieve a package, but here they claim the captain's papers are not in order, so I wait. Che seccatura. I could be here all day. Let me see what I can do. I know a few ways to bend the rules. Do you now? See, si. I will meet you back at your shop. Sofia Sartor. Perfetto. Salute, Ezio. Any luck? Mademigella Sofia Sartor, Libraia, Constantinopoli. Oh no, look at the damage. Did they use this to fight off pirates? Well, so far so good. Ah, beautiful, no? This is a print of a map by Martin Walze Müller. See here? The new lands, described by Messer Amerigo Vespucci. Poor Cristoforo Colombo. History has a strange way of unfolding. What do you make of this body of water here? A new ocean, perhaps. Most of the scholars I know claim the size of the globe has been underestimated. Incredibile. The more we learn about the world, the less we seem to know. 
Well, you honored your promise. Here is mine fulfilled. If we are correct, this should show you the location of the first book. I must admit, my head is swimming with the prospect of seeing these books. This is knowledge the world has lost, and must have again. Perhaps I could print a few copies to distribute myself. Or a small run of 50 or so, that should be enough. <laughs> Perché ridi? Forgive me. It is a joy to see someone with a passion so personal and noble. It is inspiring. Goodness, where is this coming from? Grazie, Sofia. I will return. Salute! I am closing in on two more books. One near Topkapa and the other in the Bayside district. Bayside first. Topkapa will be a dead end. Ah, see. What do you make of this? Oh, Ezio. Incredibile. Early Coptic bindings. Still in good shape. Amazing. This must be a third century transcription of the original. Sophia, what happened here? Oh, that happens once or twice a year. People break in thinking they will find money. I do not keep much here, but this time they made off with a portrait of some value. It is a shame. You keep working. I will find your painting. Ezio, the thief could be anywhere by now. If the thief came for money, but took a painting, he should be close by, eager to get rid of it. Well, if you happen to find it within the next few hours, meet me by the aqueduct. I will be running errands. Where is it, Labro? Confess! I have done that. I do not need to. I will just keep hitting you until you talk. I found that. I mean, someone gave it. Get your stories. Do not care how you got the painting. Just tell me where it is. I sold it to a merchant in the bazaar. How else will I feed myself? Next time, find a nicer way to be a canalia. It is a good likeness, don't you think? I prefer the original. <laughs> Buffone. This was a gift from my father for my 28th birthday. I had to sit for Messer Albrecht Durer for a full week. Can you imagine me sitting still for seven days doing nothing? I cannot. Una tortura. <laughs> so, I found you another book location. And it is not far from here, actually. Grazie. Ezio, what is this all about? You are not a scholar, that much is clear. Do you work for the church? <laughs> Not the church, no. But I am a teacher, of a kind. I will explain one day, Sophia, when I can. Enjoying the poem? Who were these men he condemned to hell? Political opponents. Men who wronged him. Alighieri's quill cuts deeply, no? See, si. It is a subtle way to seek revenge. Ezio. I plan to make a trip to Andrianopoli in a few weeks to visit a new printing press there. That should be fun. It is a five or six day ride from here. 
And I will need an escort. Prego. Oh, I'm sorry. You are a busy man. Sophia, I would love to accompany you, but my time is running short. That is true for all of us. Well, I can try to solve this last code now, but I need to run an errand before sundown. Can you wait a day? What do you need? It is silly, but a bouquet of fresh flowers. White tulips, specifically. I can get you the flowers. Nessun problema. Are you sure? It would be a nice change of pace. What is this? A gift. Sit. Che belli, grazie. I wanted to thank you for letting me play a small role in your adventure. A small role is enough for this adventure, believe me. <laughs> you are a mystery, Etia Auditore. Mi dispiace. I do not mean to be. It is fine. È affascinante. Sembra squisito. Why, thank you. Any luck with the final code? Ah, the code, see. Si. I solved it many hours ago. You will get it soon enough. Yusuf, wait. Un favore. Yes? There is a woman running a bookshop at the old Polo trading post. Sophia. Look out for her. She is a remarkable lady. You have my word. Disappoint me, Ahmed. Why the Templars? Because I am tired of all of these pointless blood feuds. That pit father against son. Brother against brother. To achieve true peace, mankind must think and move as one body, with one master mind. The secrets in the Grand Temple will give us just that, and Altair will lead us there. Delusions! Altair's secrets are not for you. I am not interested in arguing, Ezio. I am here for the Masia of Keys. Keys? Are there more than this one? So I have heard. Perhaps I should ask someone who knows better. Sofia Sarto. Is that her name? She knows nothing. Leave her be. We shall see. I will kill you if you touch her. I know you'll try. brother. Requiescat in pace. Brothers, sisters, the whole city rises against us, while Yusuf's murderer waits and watches from the arsenal, laughing. Fight with me. ...and show him what it means to cross the Assassins.
Where is she? <laughs> Such fury. Where is she? If you think you are in a position to negotiate, kill me and be done with it. I am sorry it had to come to this. Two men who should be friends, quarreling over the keys to a library. We both strive for the same end, Ezio. Only our methods differ. Do you not see that? Peace, stability, a world where men live without fear. People desire the truth, yes. But even when they have it, they refuse to look. How do we fight this kind of ignorance? Liberty can be messy, Ahmed. But it is priceless. Of course. And when things fall apart, and the lights of civilization dim, Ezio Auditore can stand above the darkness and say proudly, I stayed true to my creed. I will open that library, and I will find the Grand Temple. And with the power that is hidden there, I will destroy the superstitions that keep men divided. Not in this life, Ahmed. Bring the seals to Galata Tower when you are ready. Do this, and Sophia will be spared. My brother's army will be here soon, Ezio. After that, everything changes. Mentor? Now should be a time for remembrance and mourning, I know. But our enemies do not permit us that luxury. Yusuf thought highly of you, assassin. And I find no reason to second-guess this judgment. Do you have it in your heart to lead these men and women, and to maintain the dignity of our order, as Yusuf did with such passion? It would be an honor. Bene, I am glad. Our enemy is close. Take positions around the tower, and wait for my command. Where is she? I admire you, Ezio. But your bloodlust makes it hard to call you a friend. Bloodlust? A strange insult from the man who ordered an attack on his own nephew. He was to be kidnapped, Ezio. Not killed. I see. Kidnapped by the Byzantines, so that his uncle could rescue him and be heralded a hero. More or less. Now, the keys. First, the girl. <laughs> She's all yours. Sophia! Tell your men to back off. She's all yours. Are you hurt? <coughs> not, not hurt, but very confused. I did not mean to drag you into this. I am sorry. And you are not responsible for the actions of other men. All this will be over soon, but I need to recover what they have taken. I do not understand what is happening, Ezio. Who are these men? 
Run! What now, Ezio? How does this end? I am wondering that myself. Home! Soldiers! Selim is not your master! You serve the Sultan! You carry out his command alone! Where is he? Where is the Sultan? He stands before you, brother. Father made his choice. <coughs> Sell him! Stop! Please! <coughs> so, you are the assassin. Ezio Auditore. I am Selim, Suleiman's father. He speaks quite highly of you. He is a remarkable boy with a magnificent mind. Were it not for his endorsement, I would have you killed where you stand. Leave this place. Do not return. <laughs> you did the right thing, Ezio. This is not your fight. Where does one end and the next begin? <laughs> <laughs> 